In a sewing shop, I buy loop and hook Velcro by the meter, two inch sew in. I avoid the peel and stick version as glue melts in high temperatures. I also buy strong nylon thread. I have nine hook bases in the car from which the loop curtains hang. The first four bases are the roof handles. Using a sewing machine, I stitch strips of hook Velcro together, then sew it by hand onto and around each roof handle. The top and bottom horizontal strips are loop pieces to stop the hooks from ripping the roof fabric. Bases 1, 2, 3, 4. Next, the two sun visors. I take a strip of hook Velcro and wrap it around the sun visor, locking it into place with loop Velcro on the back. No sewing is required. Next I run a piece of hook Velcro from rear roof handle through the hatchback. On one side it is anchored by thread wrapped around the roof handle, on the other side tied to the bottom of the hatch door spring. Bases 5, 6, 7, 8. The final piece is the tricky one. It runs along the hatch door and hangs into the car. In a Civic there are no handles or hooks to attach anything to back here, so it takes a few attempts to get it to work. I cut a piece of cloth, reinforce it with loop Velcro. The top of the cloth is held up by thread, run through the holes in the hatch door hinges. The sides of the cloth are sewn with loop Velcro to interlock with hook bases 7 and 8. These anchors create enough tension to hold the cloth up and hang the curtains, yet are minimal enough not to damage the rubber seals, springs and hinges of the hatch. The outer cloth is not very charismatic looking, however once the hatch is closed it is out of sight. The visible inner part that hangs in the car blends with the interior and has four small squares of hook velcro I attach the back curtain to.